Hello and welcome back to Gnome Regards Journey. We are here in Crescent Reach to pick up the uh, next part of the uh, gift that we're making for... Uh, I'm not sure who we're making it for, but we're making a gift for somebody. <laughs> so let's see here. Oh, we got a shopping list from this guy. Uh, collect pond water. Uh, loot two spider silk and one... Mess of spider spinneret. So, all right. I guess you. Ha I can't prelude these things. So, all right. Let's go ahead and we gotta head back there now. Uh, I also picked up uh, a quest. I was looking around. Because uh, when we were in uh, Black Feather Roost, we picked up this feather on the ground, and it was for another quest. And it looks like we we did get credit for it when I grabbed that quest from uh, the the lady. She's around here. Yeah, right here. So I was I was trying to see if we would uh, get credit for preluding that or not. <laughs> so uh, well, we won't be doing that quest until we get to Blackfeather Roost, though. So all right, let's get out of here. All right, we're back here in the mesa, and uh, here is Pioneer Valu. Uh, we needed this for the Wonderlust Guild, so we're gonna go ahead and grab, uh, get that taken care of. Uh, main chat, does he have anything to say to us? There we go, beasts, satyrs, stumbled, investigate, there we go. Uh, what is this one? Uh, explore the camps. Okay, so this is going to be pretty easy. Okay, we need to collect pond water. So let's go ahead and go over here and do that first, actually. Let's unlock this, because it's probably going to send us around. This Wonderlust Guild stuff is all pretty much a go explore here or go explore there, so... I don't think there ever there's ever any uh, combat involved, so let's just get that tagged. There we go. Let's just run around for a second. We're going to have to probably spend a little bit of time here in this camp. Trying to figure out how to <laughs> trigger that stupid last uh, stimu quest item. Alright, so here's the mess of recluses we need anyway. So let's go ahead and uh, start getting these guys killed. Not sure where my pet's at. All right, let's get off this mount so I can navigate better. Oh, we got everything in one one shot. Jeez, that's hilarious. Okay, so uh, well, I'd already pulled these, so come on. All right, pond water near. So we need to go right here. Uh, there is a bridge right. Whoa, jeez. I think there's a bridge right over here we can take. And not lose our mount. Yeah, there's the bridge. Perfect. Now we're still gonna have to lose the mount though, because he's on the other side of the bridge. Explore the caves behind. Yeah, we should have probably did that. Uh, all right, we need pond water near the pond near this guy. So let's just jump in. Typically, these collect pond water things, you just jump in the water and it triggers. It's not like a clicker. Not a... Yeah, he didn't give us an item, so... swim around for a second or two. There we go. We got our pond water. We got ten of them, actually. Uh, let's put that behind my real drink. Okay. Create one. Huh. Hey, a lot of crafting. 
And I don't know what those craftings are. Let's see here real quick. A spider silk filter using trade skills. One chilled pure water using trade skills. One deliver one pond water. Alright, so these are the optionals. We can turn them in and pay him money. And he'll make it for us. Or we can do it ourselves. And Origins is not up, so we're not going to do that. Uh, let's go explore the caves real quick. Maybe we can uh, get these other two knocked out of the way. Because we need to go back to POK probably to craft this. In theory, we'll see. I'm not 100% sure on that at this point in time. Oh, we got a we got aggro. Let's go ahead and kill it. I, there's a post on Alakazam about a, like a group of people camping this, and I guess they never got it. And I, miss, I guess at some point in time it was a really rare spawn, but it was quite a quite funny when I read that. They were like getting their kills stolen by a uh, necromancer or some guy, and it was just like. I don't know, it seems to spawn so often that I'm kind of skeptical. So those are actually have a little bit of tribute value. And we don't need the pelt, we already did that. Let's take the bridge. There we go. So we are, we are like two quest lines, I think. Maybe three until we're done with uh, the stone. My, uh, my quest, <laughs> like I have a note file with all the quests in it and stuff like that. And like little notes on telling me like what I, like the gist of uh, what I need to do for each quest and things to look out for. And uh, I think I'm down to just, just uh, two to go. All right, explore the toughen camp. Whoa, what is this dude? <laughs> oh yeah, this is giant giant uh giant tinkering uh cock clockwork gnome all right now we need to go to the other camp still don't know what this guy does during the day where's he at oh wait there's a quest here i forgot um Oh, let me find it real quick. They are coming from Praetor. Praetor. Where's Praetor? Thought I saw him over here on the map. There he is. Yes, to stop them. They don't know why they've been raiding us, but uh, you must go help. They are coming. All right, here we go. Confront the later raiders as they come in from the lowlands. We go down here. I'm assuming they're going to be toughen. Toofen, or whatever they're called. So we can go ahead and kill them if we see them. And so, from what I can understand, this quest is there's waves of mobs, uh, and there's a level 60 captain, and then we get a plus two mana regen augmentation when we uh, complete this quest. So, definitely worth waiting if we can, uh, if it actually, if, we, if they spawn. These, some of these scripts are kind of slow. There's now that's a minnow scout. Yeah, they're kind of slow, so it takes a little bit of time. Let's see what this pet hits for. Seventy-five. It's just weird how like the mercenary hits for almost double. 
That's just crazy. I would rather my pet be strong than the mercenary. So I'm not seeing any of these raiders yet. Oh wait, there's a guy. Are they gonna spawn over here? No, I don't. <laughs> Is this for? Let's see, let's look at the quest real quick. It's a task. Draken Raiders. I don't see anybody yet. I mean, it is a task, so if we fail, we can always get it again, but... Is it more over here, maybe? It's just him. I think I tried to get this quest early on, but I couldn't figure out how, where they spawned. Or where they come from. Cause I mean they're like they they have their own little enclave up there, so it's not like they have to worry about anything. Scout. Another scout. Man, this is, uh, this is interesting to say the least. Another scout. Maybe they're closer to the zone line? I don't know. Let's just run down here and see what we see. I don't want a zone, so... Nope, nothing there. There's some men over here. Nope, nothing over that way. Nothing over here. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, to me, this is the lowlands right here, right? All right, let's uh, let's just wait for him for a second. All right, I just looked the quest up after waiting for a little bit. It's up here at the Sunder Rock uh, zone line, so we're gonna have to go all the way up there, which is uh, quite a quite a jaunt from where we were. I mean, there's no mention of it in the uh, quest description. Thought he might be a rare, he looked huge. So we'll get up this way, and we should be able to uh, take care of the rest of this quest. And then uh, my origin's up, so we can go to Crescent Reach, and I'll just do that real quick. I'm gonna try the combines myself. But we need to, uh, actually, let's, we'll go to POK, I think. Probably quicker. Ah, oh, jeez. Three centaurs. Let's just turn around. These centaurs are like really annoying.
come on. I saw that I uh, later on in, in the leveling, there's a twin cast life tap thing. And I thought, I thought that was kind of cool. So you could like double life tap. Oh, it looks like the pet killed his first. Come on. It's got like two dots on it, so. And we are 84% into the level, so. We are doing fairly well. Alright, it's supposed to update when you get over in this area. There's a Draken Raider right there. So we're just gonna try to get all these guys dead. Do a vex. Uh, we need to lich. I'm not sure why. I must have clicked that off when I was in POK. I love that. <laughs> These orbs are just so awesome. These have a lot of hit points. What level are they? 56. All right, looks like the the uh, this one is a caster healer, so druid. So we're going to have to uh, eliminate her as soon as possible. Do a Vex on her. And Companion, there we go. 28 Platinum, holy crap. Alright, we got three more of them incoming. What was that? Ice Comet? Alright, we might have to get off our mount so we can run around a little easier. Just dot them all up, I guess. this guy do? Here, let's get on the other side of this one. And uh, start dotting him up. And I don't have a real life tap memorized, unfortunately. on this one. Kill the pet. Alright, that one's wasting all its mana healing, so... Alright, one's down. Get her redotted up. Let's get 
X going. Venom Bolt. Alright, that worked out. Um, let's heal the pet before he dies. Alright, we got the captain. And two more raiders, so... Oh, this is a... This is a... Quite a fight. Oh wow, this guy just obliterated my pet before I even noticed. So let's uh let's dot him up. Let's see if we can summon a pet before we get hit. There we go. Alright, we wanna snare all these guys. I have a feeling you're going to have to kite a little bit. So I wonder what's in Sunder Rock Springs that uh, the Draken are kind of uh, wanting to attack things. Alright, I'm going to use an orb on her. Ideally, I want to get this captain done first. He's he's the highest level. Try to root them all. No, I guess he lost snare. <laughs> uh, let's see here. All right, captain's down. All right, I guess we don't have to kill these ones, but let's go ahead and uh, she's doing a good job on that, so. Gonna have to resnare as soon as this one drops. Heal myself. Uh, I should probably heal her next. There we go. That should work out better. Pet is getting owned. And I cannot mend him, so... I'll use an orb on him. Next orb goes to her. He's doing Venom Bolt. Nine seconds on an orb. Kill him, please. All right, gosh. Thirty nine platinum for that kill. Wow. It's like killing a hill giant. All right, let's resnare him so we can uh, make do. Uh, all right, we need to return to the minnow camp. So I am actually going to levant our way over there. 
because it's less than a 10 second run or more than a 10 second run so I'll do that and it's a fairly ca fast casting spell I can't wait till we get the AA so I don't have to memorize it that'll make uh make farming things a lot easier all right where are we <laughs> Uh, we we're at the zone in, okay. <laughs> I was like, what? This doesn't look familiar. Alright, step one, go up to the camp. We'll do that. Like, that quest took up like almost all the time that I was allotting for this. So that's crazy. Alright, we need to talk to you. All right, we got a yeah, 10. Oh yeah, more than that. We got a 10 to everything Aug plus two mana region. Then we got a pretty nice healing necklace, flawed scryer's necklace. So we'll go ahead and take that. Uh, I don't believe that is an upgrade over the rough one. Yep, it is. Healing three, so we'll go ahead and take that. Uh, put this one right here. Let's go ahead and put that AUG in our robe for now. And this stuff can be dealt with. Alright, let's go over to the Tuffin camp and explore that and get this uh, Wonderlust Guild thing checked off our box here. Uh, and then we're, we'll have to gate to POK to do all these combines. I didn't bring my, uh, I didn't bring any of my uh, kits except for my jewel crafting one that I grabbed out of the bank last episode. All right, we're going to have to swing low down here, or I'll we'll aggro all those guys up there, and I don't really feel like killing all those. Okay, we got that. All right, looks like we got a Toughen Guard chasing us. I'm just going to let him get destroyed by our mercenary. Oh, jeez, they have such an aggro range on them. All right, we need to find... Potamide, which I believe are right over this way. Oh, let's put her on assist mode. There's Potamide. Yeah, we found him. I don't know what the trigger is. There we go. That was the trigger. Alright, search for the centaur. He is right over here. And we're going to... Levitate. We're going to get Dead Man floating going. Alright, we got that one. Hissing Bend Ridge. Hissing Bend Ridge. Um, I guess it's this up here where all these snakes are. Or over here, maybe? Hissing Bend Ridge. Maybe uh, on this side. That's quite the uh, generic name for something, really. I mean, it's hard to find some of these things. 
All right, that's not it. <laughs> so let's see. Hissing Bend. Uh, maybe Goods Map has a name on here. Yeah, he's got like these. There's Hissing Bend ri uh, Bridge right there. I was looking for a ridge because I cannot read today. That's what we want right there. Guess we cannot get it from being high up in the air. Nope. Explore the wind willow on the mesa. So that's up this way. Pretty much a little zone, zone tour, if you will. <laughs> get everything, uh, everything explored. Oh, we still haven't figured out what this guy does. He's like totally doing his own thing. All right, I should uh, trigger up here. Here we go. Speak with Reagan. All right, so we can go back to Crescent Reach for him now. Perfect. And speaking of that, let's go ahead and gate to uh, POK and try to do these turn ins real quick. I mean, not turn ins, but combines. We need a spider silk filter. All right, let's get off the mount. Where's the instructions? There we go. Spider silk filter can be made. Sewing kit with two spider silks and a silk combine. Where's the loom? Let's just get our sewing kit out of the bank. That's a fletching kit. Here's a large sewing kit. We want this one. All right. All right, we only have 174. This is uh, going to be tricky, I guess. All right, two spider silk. Experiment. And one of these. Cannot combine these items. Oh, we need a uh, celestial essence. What the hell is celestial essence? Uh, let's go over here to the tailor vendor. I think it's this one. Smithing supplies, pottery, smithing. Here, let's take loading off so we can actually get close. Nope. Oh yeah, the tailor guy's over here on this side. It might be easier to just go pay this guy 10 platinum. Uh, then, uh, yeah, I don't know where the celestial essence comes from. Okay, this is actually a uh, Interesting thing. <laughs> Celestial Essence is uh, another crafted item. So we need a mixing bowl. And some solvent. Jeez, this is like... This is pretty crazy. So we can go over to... Alright, we gotta go over to the poison guy over here. He not doing business with me. All right. Order and puzzle. Uh, there it is, the Centimar. So we're going to get uh, a few of these, I think. Let's get one more.
And then we need a con concentrated celestial essence solvent. By Darius, I think that's the guy. Darius. Darius Grundle. And we go on a little journey to find this guy. Guess he's over here. Oh, okay. He's the, uh, he's this guy. Okay, that makes sense. All right, concentrated solvent right here. We need one of those. Let's get two. Oh, there's celestial solvent. Is that what we need? No, we need Celestial Essence. Never mind. <laughs> All right. Uh, does he have the mixing bowl? No. What is it? All right. Here, Clen Iron Stove here has a mixing bowl. All right. Jeez, that was... That was a lot of work. All right. Uh, experiment. Let's take this stuff out. Experiment. We need to put one uh, and that. Uh, what is it? Da, 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 no. That doesn't go in there. Those go together. Three of these. There we go. We got three celestial lessons from that. Okay. Uh, I'll go da, that and we'll do one more like that. And we get another three. All right, we got the mixing bowl. Got that done. Uh, let's put that over here. I, for some reason, didn't need a mixing bowl the whole uh, whole leveling up process. So, all right, we got two spider silk. Silk compound and celestial essence. All right, we got our filter. Let's actually make another one of those, <laughs> just in case. Uh, one of these. Oh, that's one of those is our filter. Yeah, that one's that. There we go, we got two filters. All right, so now we need to go over to this thing. A filter. Pond water. Where'd the pond water go? One pond water. One ever chilled whatever. That looks right. Oh, good. I did that. All right, we got it. <laughs> Oh, it's a refreshing drink, too. So we need to make sure we put that below everything else. All right. So we got a spider silk filter now. That's an extra. And some celestial lessons. So put those in the bank. All right. So we need to deliver that back to him there. And we're good to go. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. I think we're at like 45 minutes or something like that. And I don't know how much I'll be able to cut out and make it still make sense. So we are going to uh, cut it here. i uh, going to start back in uh, Crescent Reach to turn this in. And then I'm going to run from Crescent Reach up to uh, Mesa and turn this in. And then we'll get the next one. So uh, thank you for watching and have a great day.